So here we introduce the element by markup two. It is using a blue beam where we can place a uh, markup. Here we have placed a bunch of markups in here. And once we place these markups, it uh, record over here and has a X, Y point. We export this um, summary into a CSV file like that. And after this is done, we can use those CSV files, essentially read that, read the X, Y's. And here, if I run this, it will uh, open that CSV files, read all these X, Y point, and try to place the device in here. So notice that these devices are um, relatively centrally, pretty much clear, close to where actually those devices are placed in Bluebeam. And it get placed like that. And knowing that in the past we have introduced the snap element to wall and element snap to ceiling, what we can do is put them into this workflow as well. So if I run the version 2, notice how these outlet has been snapped to the wall. The light is still down here. And if we run the version 3, it will try to snap the light to the ceiling as well. Essentially, this workflow combined we could uh, place everything in Bluebeam and read those markups and translate that into Revit, saving a lot of time. So here I'm using these outlet to represent a specific family in Revit and whether it needs to snap to wall or if it needs to snap to ceiling. You can read my full video for the complete descriptions. And here we go. Now it finishes. Everything has been placed next to the ceiling, next to the wall, like a small mess over here, but then we can always run this to put it back really quick. Now the thing looks uh, really good. Okay, here we go.